Britney Spears can't seem to catch a break. The other night, she was backhanded and thrown to the floor by an NBA player's security guard. Hey besties, so we need to talk about what happened with Britney Spears the other night. The other night, Britney Spears was backhanded, slapped, thrown to the floor by Victor Wembanyama's security guard. I have a lot of questions when it comes to this incident because first of all, did they not realize that this was Britney Spears? As in the Britney Spears? As in our Y2K queen Britney Spears? Like, hello sir, you need to back off. But let me just get you all caught up. So I am have this article here on TMZ. It says, Britney Spears smacked in face by San Antonio Spurs security. Wanted pick with Victor Wembanyama. So it says, Britney Spears was allegedly assaulted Wednesday night in Vegas after a member of Victor Wembanyama's security backhanded her in the face and she has filed a police report. The incident went down at Catch Restaurant in the Aria Hotel around 8.30 p.m. Brittany, along with her husband, Sam Asghari, and two others went to the restaurant for dinner. She was swarmed by fans as she entered the casino. Brittany walked over to Catch, and as they were entering the restaurant, Brittany spotted Victor. We're told she's a fan and went over to him to ask if they could take a photo together. She tapped him on his back, right shoulder, and we're told the director of team security for the San Antonio Spurs, the team that drafted Victor last month, instantly backhanded her, causing her to fall to the ground, knocking her glasses off. Brittany composed herself and went to her table. We're told the security guy came over to the table and apologized. He said, you understand how it is when you're being swarmed by fans. He apologized and Brittany accepted it. By the way, we're told he also said when he slapped her, he didn't know who she was. Brittany's security team spent time with Victor's security guy and afterward, her team filed a police report with the Metropolitan Police Department alleging battery. So I've heard some conflicting reports about this. I've heard that they say that she didn't just tap him on the back, she grabbed him from behind. When you're Britney Spears, what happens in Vegas doesn't stay in Vegas. The pop star was reportedly knocked to the ground last night by a security guard, apparently, who didn't realize who she was. That's Britney Spears in Las Vegas last night, heading into a hotspot restaurant where she was reportedly slapped so hard by a security guard, she fell to the ground. According to reports, Brittany was dining out on the Vegas Strip at a restaurant called Catch when she spotted top NBA pick Victor Webinyama, who she's a big fan of. But when she tapped the 7'5 player on the shoulder, his security guard allegedly backhanded her, causing her to fall to the ground, knocking the glasses off of her face. The security guard reportedly claims he didn't know who she was. In this TMZ video, she's seen entering the restaurant wearing a black hoodie and dark sunglasses. That's her husband, Sam Ashkari, walking behind her. When the security guard realized it was Brittany, he apparently apologized, telling the pop star, you understand how it is when you're being swarmed by fans. Brittany, who posted this dancing video right before going out, reportedly was so upset she filed a police report. Vegas police tell Inside Edition they responded to the restaurant regarding a battery investigation. No arrests were made. As far as I've seen, there's no footage of the actual incident going down. There is a photo of Brittany walking up to him, behind him. But I mean, I'm eager to see if anybody has actual footage of the incident taking place. Because you would think that somebody would have evidence, like it's Britney Spears, plus it's an NBA team. So you would think that with all these, you know, celebrities being there, somebody would be filming. Apparently, Victor Wembanyama is 7 foot 4, 7 foot 3, which is... <laughs> That's crazy, like that's over two feet taller than me. Brittany, I think, is maybe a couple inches taller than me, so she must have been reaching up pretty far to try to tap him on the shoulder, so maybe his security saw her sort of reaching for him, and that's when they backhanded her, but they should not have backhanded anybody. I mean, if I was a celeb and my security backhanded a fan, I would be distraught. I'd be firing that security guard ASAP. So I'm really glad that Britney's team is filing a police report because that's not okay. And they shouldn't be backhanding anybody, but they especially shouldn't be backhanding women. Like that's just not okay. If I were Victor Wembanyama, I would feel so embarrassed. I would be so apologetic. Like I would have paid for Britney's whole dinner. Like I would be so embarrassed that my security hit a fan and knock them to the floor. 
Like I would just be begging for forgiveness, trying to do anything that I could do to make it right. I mean, there have been conflicting reports about this with people saying, how could Britney tap him on the shoulder? Like she claims that she did when he's literally like two feet taller than her. But there was a video that somebody captured of Britney entering her hotel earlier that day with her entourage. And it looks like she's wearing pretty high heels, like four or five inch heels. So maybe that could explain why she was able to, you know, tap him on the shoulder. It's just so sad. Britney Spears has been through so much. I've covered Britney Spears a little bit on my page already, but Britney has been through so much in the past with, I've, I feel like we all know by now, like what she's been through with the whole conservatorship and her toxic team and her toxic family. But it's just really sad that somebody else who's a complete stranger, somebody else's security would treat her like literally assault her. I just hope that Britney doesn't feel like this type of treatment is like normal because it's not normal. Britney doesn't deserve this type of treatment. I mean, she's been tossed around and abused by her family and her team for so long. I just I'm really glad that she's pressing charges because she does not deserve this. And yeah, I'm just really surprised that Victor has not come forward and apologized because if I were Victor, like I know I keep saying this, but if I were Victor, I would feel so embarrassed and bad that my security was acting out in that way. But what is your guys' take on this? Have you been keeping up with this? How do you feel about the whole situation? You probably have heard about it because it's like taken over the internet right now. But let me know in the comments and let me know if there's any other topics that you want me to cover. I have a lot more videos that I'm working on right now. So make sure you subscribe so you don't miss when I upload next. And I'll keep you guys updated if anything progresses with this story. But yeah, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.